Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. This is Amber. I'm going to be doing uh, some organization in my bathroom today. The thing about my bathroom is that um, when we bought this um, house, it was a foreclosure and it was one of those uh, you get what you get and you don't throw a fit. So the bank had come in and they had done some remodeling because obviously there had been some issues before. Um, but it's very low quality remodeling and honestly uh, it's going to take us a while to get through any of the bigger projects. We've been focusing on like um, important infrastructure type things like water heater and uh, toilets and things like that. So um, I'm not going to be doing anything very um, extreme with this bathroom makeover organization. I'm mostly just going to be coming down and trying to make it work for me for now. Because So I want to tell you that up front because um, some things about the cabinets and the uh, underneath the sink, uh, they're not they're not great, but at least you'll see a little bit of organization and I hope that is inspiring. So let's get into it. All right, so this is the before. And never mind the big hole in the back. That's been there forever. As you can see, very, very unorganized. Looking at the drawer. So this is the top drawer. It's the one that I usually use for makeup. Again, not in the least bit organized. <laughs> I was brushing, cleaning a brush with that or So, come on back in there. And then the second drawer. Yeah, this is a lovely thing I have to fix at some point. <laughs> um, yeah, not much organization. Still just working on it. So, this, like, train wreck is what I need to be fixing. Okay, so I have assembled all of my organizational um, materials and I'm going to get started organizing this under cabinet, um, under bathroom sink cabinet. So I've already started. I took some of these crates from the dollar store and I went ahead and slid them back here and the lovely thing about modular organizers is the fact that you can kind of customize so I've got this pipe in the way I've got these um, like insect things that I don't want to mess with so I'm going to take these and I'm going to just put them in front and I've got another one. Oops. So I'm going to put this in here. And they click together. They kind of stack together. So make sure that's all sturdy. And then I've already got one of these risers. And I'm going to put that in over here. Okay. So now I can add some other organizers. So I don't have a whole lot of, of tools, but I do have some hot tools that I've got in this Sterilite bin. And I'm going to just stick them down here. And um, I'm just going to put some extra hair dye. There's space at the top here. I'm going to stack them at the top. And then I've got this full of my makeup extras. And I'm just gonna make it a little better. And here, I don't access it very often, but the nice thing is, 
is that this fits with the lid up so I don't even have to pull it out. I can just set that down there like that. I have this that I use as kind of a travel pack for hair stuff. And I'm gonna stick that in there on the side. Uh, I've got this little thing of, I can push that back, put that there. And these are all my like funky little tools, my toothbrushes and things. I use them. And it fits in that back area there. And then my hair, like mousse and stuff, fits right there. And then I have room for some bits and pieces here. I'm just going to stick these in in no particular order. So here is the completed cabinet. and way more functional than the old one. Still have the pole in the back, but that's kind of a structural thing. A lot more useful. Things are in bins, they're easy to take out of. So, I'm happy with that. This drawer still has the uh, broken handle, but inside at least is nice and organized. So this is full of hair things. I don't have to take it out, but I can. Fits in there. I've got a lot of the hair things in plastic bags so I can pull them out easily like items. Um, this back part has extra cotton balls and pads. And I don't have to take that out and I just close it up. And this right here is my little thing of wipes that I can use to clean up my sink whenever I use it. So that works very well. So now it's the makeup drawer, and the way I set it up here is there's this little acrylic organizer from the Dollar Tree with all of like the powder, skin powder, foundation, this is like an extra eyeshadow or highlighter, um, eyeliners, this is um, my almost out Clinique eyeshadow thing, mascara, and switch hands. This is a little napkin holder that I'm storing my brushes and tools in. I've got another little acrylic thing that I've got different stuff in. It's hard to fit everything. I've got one little baggie of stuff. Um, the basically lipsticks and everything else in here. It all works. It's it's too small of a space and I'm too much of a hoarder of makeup to make it like really beautiful, but it's gonna function pretty well. So I like it. Thank you.